No, I can't find her. I feel like 20 minutes to find her. You haven't seen her anywhere? No, I haven't seen her anywhere. There's still a few places we can look. I've checked everywhere inside, like everywhere. Remy, have you seen her? No, I haven't seen her anywhere. We need to find her, we need to find her. Come on, you guys, stop standing around. We need to find her. All right, guys, so we've been moving some furniture in and some boxes in, and we've lost sushi. I think we left the door open, the front door, or it could be the side door, I'm not sure. So we're just who looking left everywhere. The front door open? Who? Who left the front door open? I don't know who left it open. It doesn't matter who left it open. <laughs> I think I've looked everywhere inside the house. I think we need to look outside. things that were missing, they just haven't been the cat. No. But we've only got about 20 minutes to find her, guys, because we've got to go pick up Charlie. She's at a play date at the moment, but I really want to find sushi before we pick her up, because otherwise we're going to have to tell her that we've lost sushi. Chris, have you seen sushi at all? No, not recently. She hasn't been in here. We've been looking everywhere. Can you come and help us? Oh, she lost. Yeah, we can't find her. We've been looking for ages. Come and help, come on. Okay, I'm Remy's, gonna... Remy's been helping. Have you been helping, Remy? I'm quit my squad. Yeah, I've been helping, but I can't find her. We need your help, Press. Maybe Sushi's somewhere walking around here. In the game? Yeah, I don't think so. Come on, Press, let's go. Sushi, hello, voice chat. <laughs> All right. Speaking to the side of the Come on, she guys. We actually have to be quick, guys, because we've got to go pick up Charlie. Yes. And I don't want to tell her that we've lost Sushi, guys. Let's find Sushi before we tell Charlie. She's not in here. I think we've got to close doors after we look in the room so she doesn't, like, go behind us. Yeah, that's a good idea. So that's you don't have any space under your bed, do you? No, there's Maybe no way drawers. to actually get under my bed unless Maybe she's. Um, oh my gosh, she's hole. in here. Chris, don't <laughs> trick us. We've been looking for ages. Come on. So what about behind this couch? We've just put this couch here, guys, because we're we sort of look for like all little spots where she would be hiding. Because I think she's still not used to the house. Yeah. Careful, Pres, don't let that fall. Yeah. Okay. We're actually just renovating this room at the moment. Just kind of in the middle of painting and getting some new carpet and stuff put down. But she's not in here. What if she's gone down the street? It's really easy for them to get down the street. We've been planning on actually like blocking it off, but yeah. we haven't been in this house for long enough to like do that. Block it, yeah. So but she shouldn't have snuck out. See, this is the problem. We're gonna close all the doors, all the doors behind us. I to get to do that. So at the beach house, guys, when she got out, it was all fenced. She couldn't get out anywhere. Right, she's not gonna be in there, Perez. Come on. But check like little corners. It's so warm. That's What's wrong? Are you locked? Yeah. You need the key. Guys, we're still getting used to this house. I know we lived here before, but we still like, it was a long time ago. I think she might be like under a bush or something. Cause you know, I think- She's been plucked up by an eagle. No, she hasn't. We don't even have eagles. Yes, we do. No, we don't. Are you kidding? Eagles, they're American. A kookaburra no, Eagles? We got eagles. eagles in Australia. Show me. Can you hear them? There we go. Is that a bin chicken? A <laughs> bin chicken. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna head down here and start looking. I've gotta find some places. There's so many little like nooks and crannies she could be in. Like she could be hiding under there. She could be like have gone all the way up and under. She could literally be in so many little places around here. Could she have got in behind here? Found a little hidey hole. I feel like she might just be like hiding under something because you know when cats get scared they tend to like hide under things. So I think I can rule out for now. She might come like around in five minutes, but for the next five to ten minutes, I'm gonna rule out that section since I don't think she'll be there. Is she in there, Rick? Or have you come for the treats? Have you come for the treats? No, find sushi, come on. Did you check down here, Prez? Yeah, I checked all around the back, like just then, and I just came around. Oh my gosh, that looks like a turtle, don't you think? It looks weird. Anyway, I just want to check like underneath. No, she's not there. Charlotte is not going to be happy. I really, we need to find her. She could be like under this hedge here. Sushi! Sushu! Remy, are you looking for sushi or eating grass? She also likes hiding under clothes, so she might be in my room. She likes to find it, like if I've left a jumper on the floor or a jacket, she'll try and jump on that. So I'm gonna have a look and see if she's, she's there. Like if anyone walks even close to Sushi, she gets scared and she gets scared really easily and runs away. So even us just walking down here, that should like, we should hear a rustle in the bushes and she should just, we should like would know that she's there. Remy, can you see her anywhere? Remy's usually pretty good at finding her, but he hasn't shown us where she is yet. She's not very good at jumping, so I don't think she'd be up high. They're not like really jumpy cats. They, they're not really built for jumping. Okay, so I'm going to head upstairs and then look over the balcony and then tell mum and Beck like if we see her, hopefully. I can't believe we've lost her, guys. This is like, everybody said you gotta be careful when you move cats because they get a bit spooked. But I don't know, I thought that we had the doors closed, obviously, so I didn't think she was gonna run out, but. I just can't find it anywhere. I just, I want to find it before we get Charlie. I don't know how long until Charlie's coming home, but I think it's going to be pretty soon. Charlie's going to flip out if we haven't found sushi and we pick her up from her play date and we have to tell her that. It's not going to be good. Is she up there? Nah, I just did a quick check around your bedroom and I couldn't find her. I have no idea where else to look. Same. We've literally looked everywhere. Let's go find sushi. Come on. All right, I'm actually relying on Remy, guys, because he's really good at finding everyone. Sushi. 
Maybe she's behind the curtains, guys. I'm just gonna stay here near the door. She always comes near the door. She always sits near this door and wants to leave. That's why we were checking out there, but she doesn't seem to be out there at the moment. Uh, what if she's like gone off the property? What if she's like... She could be. Do you want me to check? I can run or ride down. If we don't find her soon, I can call the ranger, but there's one thing. She is microchipped, but not to us. She's still microchipped to my sister. Oh, so, so then I'm gonna, gonna have to call my sister and let her know that we lost the cat as well in case she gets a phone call. Oh no, don't do that. Let's find her. All right guys, it's almost time we're gonna go pick up Charlie. It's getting a little bit late. So we're gonna have to tell Charlie, but I don't think she's gonna cry and wail and carry on. I think she's just gonna be like, she's gonna take it quite okay. She's pretty level-headed. Yeah, I think what's really good about Charlie, one of her strong points, guys, is that when bad things happen, she's really good at holding it together and just, she's really strong. And I think together as a family, as long as we all stay together and we're really strong, we can get through hard times, we can get through anything, you know, as long as we're all together. She's gonna be upset, but I think she's gonna be practical. Yeah, she's, I think she's she, really good like that. I honestly feel like we are gonna find sushi. I feel like she's gonna come back to us really soon. Even if she's away for the night, guys, I feel like somebody's gonna bring her back to us. We're just gonna have faith and, and you know, believe that there's there's good things that can happen as well. All right, just don't tell gonna... her yet, okay? I won't tell her, I won't tell her until we get home and like, I'll double check with you that you haven't yeah. found it. Well, give me, right. give me a little bit of time, okay. buy me some time. Right. Bye. See you, bye. See ya. Alright guys, I'm gonna go get Char. I'm not looking forward to this guys, I can't tell her that we've lost her. Okay, so I just had an idea, and pretty much what it is, is when your cat drinks out of their water or food bowl, then it sort of sends an alert to your phone, and I just had the idea to do it right now, because if Sushi comes for food or water, we could know that she's right there, because it, it literally gives an alert to your phone. I just want to find her and then Charlie never know anything ever happened. I feel really bad guys because I think I left the front door open when we we're moving the boxes because I remember thinking that I've got to go back and grab a really big box and I wouldn't have been able to open the door at the same time. Okay, so all I need for this is just the alfoil and a few other tiny little things like the cat's water box so she can actually drink. Oh my gosh, I'm so stressed. I don't know how I'm gonna tell her. Okay, so I'm just gonna lay down the alfoil because that's the first thing that we need. Just get that there. There. Come on. Um, <sighs> Nothing? Really? Nothing. If she gets right, out I'll, of the I'm house. I'm gonna ring the ranger and just see if she's picked up a Persian. Then, now, now that our boy was down, we just need to place that right there. I was hoping that you guys would have found it by the time I got here, but obviously <sighs> not. Call me in 10 minutes. Give me 10 more minutes. And it needs to be in a spot where if the cat is drinking out of this, it has to be touching the alfoil. Renny, if you set this off, I'm gonna be really annoyed. Did you have fun? Yeah, it's fun. Yeah? Good. If you've ever used one of these before, it's actually a really cool sort of thing. And it's really quite easy to wire this up and make it into a cat alerting system thingy. Hi. Um, what'd you guys get up to? What'd you do? Um, we chatted, we went on the trampoline, we played Roblox, stuff like that. Nice. Yeah. Chess and lunch. Yeah, we ate. Now that just needs to sit in the water like that. And if I set it up properly, it should be working right now. What have you guys been up to? Um, not much. Mm. Just hanging out. Okay, so I finally set it up, and I just really, really hope that it works. It's worked in testing. So what are we having for dinner? It's almost dinner time, guys, by the way. Yeah, I'm hungry too. Um, do you want to do homemade pizzas? Yeah, that's yeah. Nice or pasta, just forget about the names. Yeah, I don't mind. So what will happen is if Sushi touches the alcohol with her paw and at the same time drinks the water, it will start an automation over on my laptop. So watch what happens. It will send a message called cat found. Are you cooking? Me. Are you gonna cook us dinner? I can. Okay, what Wish do you do? Cook. How do you make a spaghetti bolognese? What's the first step? It then takes a photo and starts playing ding noises and then sends the photo to the family group chat. Can you boil the water and pasta in? Yep, that's the spaghetti part. But how do you make the bolognese? Oh, you do the mince and then the sauce and the chopped up carrot and uh -huh. the mushroom mm -hmm. and the tomatoes. Yeah, I think everybody makes their, their bolognese different, but that's how we make ours. It's good. But don't forget garlic and onion and stuff. Garlic and onion. Exactly. Garlic and okay. onion. That's yeah. the flavour. It's good. It's an Italian flavour. <laughs> <laughs> Mum, did you just get a message? I did. Uh, ignore it. It says cat found, but she's not. I've just set up an automation that when the cat drinks the water, it will send you a message, cat found. It'll take a photo of the cat, start playing dinging noises, and then send you the photo of the cat. Oh, that's really good. Did you go to that phone? Yeah, but I messaged her, don't listen to the next message. What's your favourite, like, dinner? If you got to pick any dinner, what would be your favourite dinner? Pizza. Pizza. Oh, why don't you pick pizza then? Oh, we yeah. can do homemade pizza. True, yeah, pizza. 
got this from Prez. What is it? Hold on. What is it? Can you guys see that? I think this is really complicated. I think we need to spend less time doing electronic stuff and more time actually looking for her. Well, if she comes back, she's gonna want water. And then oh, when she drinks what? water, it'll go through my laptop and it will send it. All right, I'll be in in just a sec, Bob. Okay. Just go on the swing since the front door probably isn't open. Yeah, good idea. All right, I'm just gonna quickly call back. I just wanna quickly check if she's found her before I let Charlie in. Hey. Hi, this is my situation. Oh, has pressed set it up. I just got the photo. I was like, what is that? But is it working? Like, does it work? We're just testing it now. Well, I haven't said anything to Charlotte yet, babe. So she's on the swing at the moment. She's out of the car, so. I think we need to tell her because she needs to help us look. All right. So the ice cream man drove fast. Did you? Can I go get my money? Uh, where are you going to go get? How? Through the car. Do you have any money? I don't have any money here. I don't have any cash. Oh, wait, I do, but it won't be enough. I've got two dollars. Two dollars. I don't think that's enough for an ice cream. It might be. I don't think it Can is. I just stay at the end of the street and wait for him and see if he comes back? Oh my gosh. Uh, yes, but wait for me, I'm gonna come with you. All right guys, it's like the perfect distraction. Charlie's just running to grab some money and I told Beck and Prez not to say anything. So I'm gonna run down the street with Charlie, get some ice cream and they'll keep looking, I guess. So hopefully they find her before she gets back. Can I come to you? Yeah, do you, is mum gonna stay back? Yeah, she said she's gonna stay and keep doing that thing. All right, we're gonna be really quick though, okay? Cause we gotta come back and help. Yeah. Ready? Are you gonna run down with her, Press? Uh, yeah. Go on, go stay with her, go stay with her. Uh, I think I'm gonna order really, really slowly, and if we be more slow. Well, no, because we have to hurry up and get back and look, Press. No, but then Charlie won't know, because Mum will probably find her, Mum's really good looking. Yeah, I know. But can you go with Charlie, please? I don't want her on her own. Go, go, go. All right, let's hope that Beck finds her while we're gone. I feel bad that we're not all there helping, but it's good to take Charlie away as well. What flavor are you gonna get? I don't know, um, <laughs> probably Choc Chop or something. Uh, Choc Chop with a flake, with... <laughs> <laughs> Chop tops with a fape. <laughs> Not here? No. Nah. Anywhere? He could have only gone further down here. It's the only road. We can't find it, guys. Are you sure it was Mr. Whippy? I'm sure. I'm so annoyed that Mr. Whippy wasn't there. I definitely saw him, though. Uh, that's okay. Yeah. Next time. Yeah. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Good. How are you? Good. Do you have a fancy sheet yet? Mm, no. no. Okay. Where was Mr. Whippy? He wasn't there. He didn't want your money. What's that? What are you doing with Sushi's water bowl? Nothing, don't worry. Don't worry about me. Don't drink from it, yeah? That's... <laughs> <laughs> I've got some news, it's not good news. Oh. Beck and I were moving some boxes in from the shed today and mm -hmm. we think that Sushi may have gotten out. We didn't see her, we didn't, like, we don't know what happened but we do know we had the door open a little bit and Sushi's well, been missing, missing all missing. afternoon. We can't find her, we've looked inside, we've looked outside. We've looked everywhere. everywhere. Yeah. I think if you help us look, she might come to your voice maybe. Just maybe try calling her because she might sushi. listen to you. Sushi. I can't believe we lost sushi guys. I've got to go try to find her in my room. Sushi. Sushi. You went to my bed? Sushi. Hey, sushi. Can call the ranger? The ranger? Yeah. I think we have to call the ranger, it's getting late. Char, we're going to call the ranger. So what happens if, uh, so what happens is when people find a cat or a dog and it doesn't have an owner with it, they can call the ranger and the ranger comes and picks it up and keeps it safe until its owner comes. So somebody may have already done that if Sushi's outside. Okay. But check your room properly. We've checked it a few times, but just call her with your voice. Sushi! I think she might respond to you better. Sush! Guys, I can't believe Sushi went missing. I've been so scared of this for ages. Let's see. She under the couch. But yeah, a lot of you guys warned me um, when you're moving house that she in here. Um, be careful of cats. Um, be careful of cats because they tend to get startled and run away. I try really hard to be careful, but I guess I just didn't do good enough. But where is she? Have you got any little hiding spots in here, Char, that she could go to? No, unless. Uh, except for under there, but it's quite open, so it's not really hiding. I'm going to check with Prez and see if his thing has worked out. Okay, hey, Prez. Yeah. Any luck on the water bottle? Uh, water bowl? No, Charlie, you don't know what water bottle is yet, do you? No. It's just an automation that notifies us if the cat drinks out of the water bowl, which is something she does all the time. So he set it up so if she goes there and steps on the alpha oil, it alerts your phone that somebody's there, that something's there. It sends a text message with a photo of the cat drinking out of the water bowl. And then also, 
play the ding sound effect so we know that it's there. I'm gonna come up and help you. Prez, you could check like in that corner over there. I haven't really checked that kind of kitchenette area. Maybe like in the little bed area. Hey guys, we've got the kids down the street. They're looking all in the bushes and stuff, but I think we should probably get in the car and do a few rounds before. Did you let all the neighbors know yeah. around there? Yeah. Okay, cool. What about, did you check this cupboard? Like, we've checked everywhere. I mean, you can check everything, but we've checked everywhere. Well, babe, Sushi. keep your phone on the, keep your phone on you because if the ranger Sushi. calls. Did you find her? Sushi. Oh my gosh, babe, she found it. Right. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hi, baby. Oh, so oh. did, Didn't you look in there? I looked in there. I looked in there. Was she? She I was, looked in there. She was right so did there. I. She was in the corner. Oh my gosh. She just made herself like a little bed on one of the one of the she bags. She was literally right there. Remy, we found Sushu. Remy, are you happy we found Sushi? <laughs> we can just tell he's so happy. They're like best friends, guys. I know. All right, guys, I'm so happy that we found sushi. Charlie, we just needed you. Don't forget to make someone smile, and we'll see you in the next one. Love you guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> just a bit my mouth, interesting.